Right, part two. So after you have dedicated the space and you said that to her, um, I would probably say a lot more, but this is the time to say it. After you've dedicated the space to her, you will sit for a few minutes. You can do a chime candle, one of those little four inch chime candles, taper candle, you can do that. Or you can do the seven day like me. Um, but now that you have dedicated the space to her, you will now talk to her and you talk to her from your heart. Make sure you can write your name on a piece of paper. Make sure when you're folding it, you fold it towards you. And then you're gonna put it underneath, underneath um, her statue or her picture and never remove it. That will stay. Never remove it, that will stay. Um, after you do that, you will, you can put a photo of yourself too underneath it and you fold it only once towards you. Um, and you place it under the statue, like I said. Um, I'm looking at my notes too. Uh, so I'll make sure that I'm telling you the right thing. Um, and then you do an acceptance prayer. And in the acceptance prayer, you will say to her, Santa Muerte, look upon me with kindness and see that I am sincere. Cast upon me your blessings, which grant me the confirmation to call upon you, to call upon your most powerful aid and courage and counsel. At this moment, I humbly place my faith in your power. Be my protector, be my hope, be my light, be my God in times of blindness, be my counsel in times of confusion, be my eyes, be my rest, be my ears in times of unknowing, be my aid in times of need, be my most powerful force who accepts me, a humble and devoted follower, amen. That's what you can say to her. Or you can say your own. Um, however you feel about her, um, you can make sure that you have some cold water. You can put some ice in it if you like. Needs to be moved in about 48 hours. You can give her some drink because I am giving her that. She does take rum. This is the rum that I'm giving her. I also gave her some of this because she liked them hard drinks, baby. She liked, and this is 170 proof. And let me tell you something. She loves that I'm doing this and I'm making a video talking about her. I actually have a class. If you want to take the class, you can go magicalladyduchess.com. I'm trying to do more stuff like this so you guys have a reference point and that you know that I do work because I do do work. Um, if you're wanting a consultation, if you're wanting a conversation, if you're wanting a reading, please feel free to book with me, magicalladyduchess.com. I just wanted to give you a couple of videos. I'm trying to give you all some new content. And since I was dedicating this new space, I thought, you know what? I'm going to come and give them this. I'm going to show them this. Please keep in mind, I did say other things and I did do other things to consecrate. Make sure you get some holy water, clean her space with holy water. I like to put her by a window that another sun is going to be in because she likes it. Um, and I have her in my living area uh, or like my den. I guess that would be like my den, my den downstairs. Um, I love her. I'm devoted to her. She's been after me for a long time, and I finally said, okay, I'm going to accept it. Um, she loves consistency, and like I said, I taught her class. It's in three parts. It took me about a month to do with everybody because she's so special, but she's so loving. She's such a great mother, and I honor her with everything in me, and I thought that I would share that with you guys, and I'll talk to y'all later. This was part two. I'll show you.